Hello you guys, this is Colatias and Mateos, and for this video is going to be one magazine update, my M and um and manga. So magazine manga. So long story short, because of all the ups and downs and backlog of things, I actually got two duplicates of this by mistake. And when I re try to return it, they told me they don't take magazines back. I'm like, oh my god. Good. So we had to talk to the manager and she said that that was fine, but it's pretty stupid that magazines don't get taken back. They pretty much said because the publishers don't want them back, but they take them back, they could just throw them away. <laughs> Logic, right? I mean, if they don't want them back, that's what they do with these things. They throw them away, man. So, but other than that, yes, I was able to get the refund back and get another mango with that, but that's for another video. You know, I really Wow. Oh, okay. Yeah, I'm getting receipts and whatnot mixed up here. I'm like, that's actually a bad thing because I want to keep everything under control. <laughs> but other than that, this is adorable, yo. Really cute. Bleh. Too cute. Little, what was it, an ice cream? Yeah, it's like ice cream. Oh, it even said ice cream, so. Oh, Speed Racer. I remember that. I remember that show. How could you not? That's like childhood memories, at least from what I remember of it. I totally remember. I don't remember names, but I remember the monkey that would always be in the back with him, I believe. And I'm sorry, I just don't remember his name. And I sort of remember her, so yeah. I mean, memories right there. Man, this... I'm like smelling in my hand because this has a funny feeling to it. And it definitely smells alright. I talk about the magazine. It's like a feeling of sandpaper. <laughs> Got it eight. <laughs> that image is hilarious. Look at Sakura. She looks funny. <laughs> we got a five here. We got another five. Midsummer part one. You know, I really don't understand why they took out the Kai Tower Midsummer. I guess they didn't want to put it there because it confused people. I hate when companies do that. <laughs> but then again, that's what they translated it to. So I guess that's why they kept it like that. Ooh, nice Jack and Dexter cosplay. Jack and Dexter. Yeah, Dexter. Amazing cosplay. So we got Assassin's Creed 9 and this one, Halo of 8. We got another 9, Life is Strange, Minecraft. God, these games I hate. <laughs> There's nothing here that's... <laughs> Finally, but yeah, I'm not surprised this got a low rating due to the fact Oh, many of the stories, not enough, numerous loading screens. Yeah, because whenever you manipulate your, uh, um, my, my brain, help me. When you pause the game, when you want to go to, like, the menu to check on your health of the characters or items, you actually have to go through a, uh, loading screen. Anytime you do that, so, yeah, not only that, but it has, like, issues of frame rate whenever you have the flashlight on and some glitches here and there and some that will crash the game, which actually happened to me, I believe, two times, if not twice, most indefinitely one. But other than that, I'm still enjoying the game. I like it. Mmm, 9 out of a 10. Yeah, too short. But I loved it. I would love to see a continuation. Oh, man. Like, oh, like a continuation of everyone here with the Kanami. Her. Uh, with Persona 3, Dancing All Night with 4. Oh, man, I would love that. A 5. Yeah, I keep hearing it's not that good. Made in a black water. And Nintendo censored rated M stuff from a rated M game. I mean, don't get me wrong. This has done other things too. Like, they censor from Mugen Souls. They completely, I believe, turned a rated M game to 
T. But if I had to take this to this, I think this is the worst. <laughs> and sensory, because other than that, Lucan Souls, I maybe personality change here and wise. I'm like, what? <laughs> Tales of Zestia, eh? not a bad review score. So it's like, yeah, Nintendo really needs to go fuck themselves. It's like, uh, but here's the thing, at least Miss America, they actually told us about the censoring, whereas Nintendo never came out and said anything about anything to this day, I think. Ooh, holy crap, I pretty much own almost everything in this page, ex except this kid. <laughs> That's scary. Really? Spring 2000, so this game has not come out yet, huh? Interesting. Stata Gudo. Stata Gudo. It's an amazing game, too bad I have not played much of it yet. Trust me, because if you start playing something and you don't play, at least with my backlog of games, yeah, I don't know when I'm going to revisit it. But yeah, very interesting, interesting volume. So, oh, it's cute. <laughs> I didn't notice it before. So there you have it, guys. I hope that you enjoyed this video, and I will see you with my manga. Which I can actually do now, because it's only one. Yay, bye.